This updates the previous part 4. Sector shape magnets and a stacking option are added. It will be concluded that inserts can more than double the machine's power handling capability. Stacking can be more effective than just increasing magnet thickness. To recap, dissipation is critical to efficiency and power handling of the coreless machine. Figures of merit can be calculated or deduced from test results. They are independent of the number of turns and corresponding gauge in the windings. Relative figures of merit only involve parameters that vary between options. In this case just flux density and winding depth between rotors. Dissipation and safe power throughput can be scaled from properties of the baseline machine. Initially, four basic options were considered. First is the built and tested baseline with rectangular magnets. The next has inserts with flux directions alternating around the circumference. The third has sector magnets with and without inserts. The fourth has deep inserts penetrating through the base. The main magnets thus sit on isolated plates. Rectangular or sector magnets may be employed. There are safety and assembly issues with all the options. Strong outside rings are needed to counteract centrifugal force. Assembly should always be operated within overall burst-proof housings. Also, inserts reduce the traction between magnets and their bases. The effect is most severe where magnets and inserts touch along their length. The results start here. All are derived from 2D finite element analysis. Vertical scale is power that options can handle while keeping to the baseline dissipation. Horizontal scale is winding thickness plus 1 mm clearance between opposing rotors. These results are for 5 mm axially thick magnets. It can be seen that inserts give significantly greater power capability than the baseline machine further increased with deep inserts. Sector magnets, here in red, show further improvements with and without inserts. Next are the results for 10mm magnets. Power handling capabilities range from 13 to 30% over the 5mm equivalents, a little less than expected. This appears due to the greater length of the more powerful magnets. Flux increase is limited by their reluctance and leakage between adjacent magnets is more than proportional to the increased drive. It is calculated that better performance for the same magnet cost should be given by double stacking the 5mm option as shown here. The central steel disc does not affect the useful flux pattern and may be eliminated or retained for convenience. In this example, flux distribution through the stators remains essentially identical to the single case. Logically, the double configuration should handle twice the 5mm power for twice the baseline dissipation. This is equivalent to root 2 times, or 40% increase, while keeping to the baseline dissipation. Calculations show that appropriate stacking gives similar improvements over all the 5mm options. Here is a summary of the total results. Similarity for baseline plus inserts and for plain sectors may be noted. It is clear that inserts offer improved power handling over all options of the baseline alternator. Sectors, naturally, offer best performances, but may be difficult to implement with inserts. Axial stacking offers greater capability than increasing magnet thickness. Because of the square law dependencies, high power and low speed machines may have very real issues. Here, the options may offer some assistance.